everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Amy Milan, and you are watching Life with Ames. Today's going to be a... Alright, alright, alright. I feel like it's been forever since I've done a Scentsy video. Life has just been so crazy with this whole, like, situation that we're in, and my work schedule changing, and homeschooling kids, and life. I'm here today because I am going to be doing a... Scentsy video? Did I even do that? I don't even remember. I think I did. But anyways, I'm going to be doing a Scentsy video about about a new collection that Scentsy has just released. It is called the Mix It Wax Collection. There's something in my eye. Now, it is this little box. Super cute. It consists of five different scents, and they are all supposed to complement each other no matter how you mix it. And I must say, um... Yeah, they all smell amazing. I opened this already and smelled them all, and I freaking love it. I already ordered me another box or another bundle just because of how amazing these scents are. So yes, you get this cute little box, mix it with this cool little Art Deco-ish type of design. You open the tab, and there is the different types of ways you can mix it, or pretty much they all go together well. I have to say, if you were the type of person that always wanted to mix scents but were too scared that it would turn out like not nice, this is the perfect collection to get. You can mix any scent and it'll come out just great. But yeah, let's start with the scents and what's inside the box. Then you have five scents in here. Um, I already used it so I will have some empty boxes but I did save a cue from each one. So yeah. Let me start off with the first scent. It is sponge sugar and vanilla, grapefruit orange, those are always my favorite, citruses, rainfall and lush greens, honeysuckle peony, peony, and juicy apple raspberry. I love that. So let me smell each one and let you guys know how they smell. Let me start off with rainfall and lush greens. Okay, this scent, this scent really, really reminds me of Making Waves, the um, scent of the month that came out with the mermaid warmer. It's got that clean, fresh, kind of sea breeze smell type deal. Um, it's a light scent, definitely. I do smell a little bit of the foliage, if you were to say, scent in the background. You could smell a little bit of some like um, greenery in it. All in all, it smells very fresh and clean, and I can see how this would be a good mixing scent. So yes, this is Rainfall and Lush Gardens, or Green, sorry. And the next one is Grapefruit and Orange, or Grapefruit Orange. As you can see, it is being warmed right now, and it smells so good. Ugh. It is like, okay. Now, Scentsy has a lot of scents that are um, citrusy with with, they have a lot of scents with grapefruit and citrus in it, and they are amazing. But this one is a little bit different. I, ugh, I definitely smell like the orange, and I smell the grapefruit. The grapefruit is not so strong. I have to say that it is more orange that I smell. But to me, it kind of reminds me of a little bit of an orange sherbet. So there's a little bit of like vanilla sweetness to it, but not so much. Um, it's definitely citrus, and with me warming it downstairs, I. That's my job. With me warming it downstairs, I definitely smell it. Like, it's all in my kitchen, and that's all I smell is citrus, and I love it. But it has a little bit of sweetness. So that, with a little bit of that kind of sweet vanilla scent in the background, um, I can see how it would complement a lot of other scents. So yes, um, this is grapefruit orange. It smells a little bit like orange sherbet, but with more citrus, yes. I love it. It smells so good. Next one is Juicy Apple Raspberry. This one, of course, is going to be very fruity. Ooh, I love it. I love it. It gives, like, a, quite a punch. Um, that's what it smells like. It smells like punch. It smells very fruity. I have this in one warmer downstairs. And it does give it a little bit of a, um, a fruity boost. Oh, I do smell, like, a strawberry scent, but it's got, like, a creamy note behind it. Um, it's really good. It does give it a little pop. Like, I have this in one of my warmers downstairs mixed with other scents, and it does give it more of, like, that fruity lift. So, I like it. It's a lot more stronger 
Then the other scents that I've smelled, I would have to say this is like the strongest one out of all of them, and I love it. This is a great scent. So it's Juicy Apple Raspberry. It smells kind of like a strawberry cream. I guess you could say it has a little bit of like a raspberry to give it more of like that fruity pop. But yeah, that's what it is. Juicy Apple Raspberry. Next one is Sponge Sugar and Vanilla. I have this warming downstairs as well, and um, along with my Grapefruit Orange and my Juicy Apple Raspberry. This smells so good. It smells like, oh my god, it smells like something. It, to me, it smells like a bag of brown sugar with a couple of drops of um, vanilla extract. It smells really, really good. And the combination of these two, it really does make sense of how it would mix well with other scents. Like, it would just give it more of like that um, like vanilla vibe in the background you know and I think with all of these it just works like it's not overpowering in any way it just gives it a bit of that little touch that you need to make it like smell very calming and vanilla-y so if you're a vanilla person and you want to have this vanilla scent added to other scents in the Scentsy collection any collection or any scent that Scentsy offers this would be the perfect scent to get. Because I know like if you do vanilla buttercream, sometimes it could be too empowering. Like, if you do any other like vanilla scent, I feel like it might be too overpowering. But this is just enough to give it that little vanilla touch. So yes, this is sponge sugar and vanilla. And last but not least is honeysuckle peony. Now I think this is more of like a florally scent. Ooh, this one's so pretty. This kind of reminds me... This kind of reminds me. Oh, it smells like a rose, like a flower, like a beautiful flower. Like it smells like um just flowers that you pick up from the ground and it has a beautiful, like fresh smelling flower scent. Do you know what I mean? But it's not a strong one. Like there are some strong flower scents out there. What scents? Like the lush gardenia, there's like the fresh cut daisies when they first had it. Like those are like scents that they were so strong, it made my eyes water because my allergies were acting up. But it smelled good, I have to say, they do smell good. This gives off the same vibe, like you smell a fresh flower, but it's not too much. It's great, and I can see how it's really good at um, mixing as well. So yeah, those are all the scents in the Mix It Wax collection. I can see why they all mix well. They only give like a little bit of a oomph. Of their star factor so yes they all are they're not too strong but they're just enough to make your house smell amazing like right now as I said I have a grapefruit and orange and I also have the sponge sugar vanilla the majority of these are warming downstairs I had one warmer that I had to fill so I went and picked juicy apple raspberry and um, these two together because of the vanilla and the grapefruit orange um, it smells like uh, rainbow sherbet downstairs like not the scent bar but the actual ice cream yeah it smells like what it smells like is a yummy 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 but it smells like a yummy yummy like ice cream parlor where all they serve is um like creamy sherbets you know like rainbow sherbet orange sherbet raspberry sherbet I don't know anything like sherbet -y. like you smell like the tartness of the fruits but you also smell a touch of the vanilla and with these two that's what I smell but to me I like more of the fruity in my sense so I put two of these cubes in one warmer and it gives it more of like that fruity scent so the fruity vibe is coming out more than the sherbet vibe so or the vanilla vibe but I like these three they do complement each other there's nothing that smells disgusting to me and um tomorrow or maybe later today I'm gonna warm these two because I think these would just go great with each other. I think these, like, this would, yeah, it would just smell good. I just can't wait. But I will let you guys know. I actually have not done my um, what I have been warming for the month of April, so I'm gonna start uh, this month today, and I will start letting you guys know how the scents are mixing very well at the end of this month. But yeah, this collection is still available, so if you guys want to get it, I will put the link down below. I don't know how long it's going to last, um, but yeah, everything in here is true. It does mix very well, and I don't think they would just mix with each other, but they would mix well with other scents as well. Like, I would definitely do the Juicy Apple Raspberry was like I think it would smell really amazing with Luna but Luna smells good with everything a lot of the tropical scents that we got from um, the spring summer line so yeah that 
that is my review on these wonderful babies here. I love this. Like I said, I already I already ordered another collection. It's on its way, hopefully soon. Um, but yeah, I will be filming more videos. I'm sorry, guys. It's been so busy. I promise I will do more videos. Um, I do have a warmer that I want to do a video of. I probably will war uh, film it later today. If not, sometime this week. It's going to be kind of late. But yeah. Um, yeah, thank you guys again for watching. If you guys want to see more sensitive videos done by me, please feel free to uh, subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, give it a like. And if you want to see more videos of what it's like to live as a military wife living overseas in Japan, subscribe to my channel as well. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys again next time. Peace.